Well, Parkville was hit hard back in 1993 by flooding, and city leaders are not taking any chances as the flooding threat moves even closer. Today, they called an emergency meeting just a few hours ago. Our Jake Peterson is live at Parkville City Hall. Yeah, and good evening to you, Amy. Uh, Parkville is one of the many cities up here to the north uh, of Kansas City that are starting to prepare. We just stepped out of this emergency meeting that is going on right now. Again, they are starting to prepare. What that means is coordinating communication efforts with the police department, the sheriff's department, also gathering a list of volunteers to help put out sandbags. Also, they want to know how, what's the best way to alert downtown merchants about what might happen or what they're expecting to happen. They will be asking for volunteers here at City Hall on Monday. Those volunteers will be putting sandbags bags out. City leaders say they know the Missouri will start to rise in about 10 days. That's what they're getting from the Army Corps of Engineers. And again, they are very cautious about the Missouri because back in 1993, the 1993 flood caused millions of dollars with the devastation right here to Parkville, especially to the downtown area. So they're taking precautions now to make sure something like that doesn't happen again. And they plan to start putting sandbags out on Tuesday. Now, again, the meeting is going on right now. And of course, we will bring you the latest on that meeting on NBCActionNews.com and tonight on NBC Action News at 10. But for now, we are live here in Parkville. Jake Peterson, NBC Action News.